Hey, what's up, guys? Obey and Brandon here with the spec see through for the iPod Touch 2G. Now, here it is spec see through in purple. Uh, before we start this video, be sure to check out Minoka once again, guys. Sorry, sorry, he is a sponsor of this video. Uh, so, be sure to check him out iPhone 3G related, Mac, uh, high quality intros, and etc. like that. Professional graphic designer. Check him out for all your needs for logos and stuff. So, here it is. I have this in a nice purple. Uh, if the sun was out right now, you guys can definitely see through this case. It looks really nice in the sun. So here it is, see through. Let's open this up. You guys know specs packaging is very nice. And it has these little things right here at the top. Very nice. Like jean clips or something. Ah, my braces hurt. So let's take it out right here. Sandwich in here. Got the case. Yeah, guys know this is one of my favorite cases in my top five cases for the 2G. It is a slider case, very nice. Let's put that back in there, put it to the side over here. So you guys can actually the bottom uh, half of the slider part of this case acts as a movie stand, and you guys can actually remove that to dock if you guys ever need to. But usually I don't have a problem docking with this case; it is very thin. And with that Sun Station dock extender I have, so be sure to check out that review on the Sun Station dock extender. You guys are wondering what I'm talking about. But as you can see on the back right here, it is a glossy case. It has spec right there, the logo, and then the company name right there. So you slide it out right here, bottom half right there. In here, no screen shield. Would have been nice if they did, but no screen shield. Put that to the side. And then here's a two-piece case right there. Now, there are no guard rolls right here, but you don't have to worry about this, guys. Um, the sides of the case hold up the back of the hold up the iPod so the back of the iPod does not touch the inside of the case so you don't worry about that guys because the sides are hold, lifting up the iPod so it doesn't when you slide it in it does not touch the back at all that's why um, I have a problem with this case so here it is make sure you got the top piece right there make sure you guys got the volume rocker cutouts and then right there very nice cutouts very thick plastic case so slide it in there not worried at all it's very thin but this the back of this case is not touching the back of the iPod don't worry about that guys <coughs> excuse me and then I don't know if you guys can see it but it blends in with the case which I really like uh, the guardrail uh, not the guardrails the grips on each side so the case is not slippery in your hand like the in case slider uh, very nice I like to hold on to the case so you don't have to worry about dropping it here's the bottom of the case some nice little wicked cutouts. And that is, serves its purpose as a movie stand. Just go like that. Place it between these two. These two right here. Boom, you got your movie stand. Don't have to carry around another movie stand. So it works great. Either side. Works great. So then when you, when you take the bottom piece. Also works great with docking. So you don't have to pull out the whole case to dock. Right there. Slide the bottom piece in. Covers the bezel real nice, locks up real nice. There's a lot. There's a bump right here, a bump right here. Same as on this side too, a bump right here and bump right there, which locks these pieces together. You guys heard that right? That was it locking. So it covers the bezel real nice, guys. I really like how it's kind of pointy right here around the bezel. Doesn't show no bezel. It's a very slim case, no bulk added whatsoever. It goes in out the pocket real nice. What I really like is these guardrails. Some people don't like them, but I really enjoy them. Trust me, guys, you will enjoy it too. Um, it actually helps with the grip, improves your grip, so you don't have to worry about it sliding out your hand, like falling out your hand and dropping it. Drop protection, really nice. Got your bottom dock fully exposed for your docking needs, headphone jack, fully exposed. Everything right there. Easy to access volume rockers, same as the sleep wake button, guys. This is a very easy to use case, has that lip, the end table design. Very easy to use case, guys. It's simple. Comes in simple colors, guys. It even has a clear one, but the grips are black, which you guys might not like. But all the other cases are the same color. The grips are the same color as the case, so you don't have to worry about that. At the bottom, it says, made, designed in California, made in Taiwan. So that's different. The other fitted said, made in China. So here we have the spec see-through. Take it off. Pop off the bottom. These pieces stay on very nicely tight, so you don't have to worry about the bottom piece falling off. Very hard plastic. Though it is kind of flimsy right here, uh, it's very kind of thin right there. You can see it's flexing. But this is another nice feature that movie stand I told you guys about earlier. So be sure to check them out. Spec, um, see, uh, 
spec see through at specproducts.com. Very nice two piece case. Really enjoy it. It's one of my top cases, as you guys can see. There's little things right here. I think it's. No way that came from it. Uh, both, um, both of my see throughs, I ha always had this problem, but it's not scratching the back of my iPod whatsoever. I'm not worried about that. I'm just, I don't even know where these two marks came from. But be sure to check them out at specproducts.com and be sure to check out Padoka, guys. Thanks for watching. Oh, baby, Brandon signing out. And I'll catch you guys in the next video, guys. Oh, and what you're seeing is like, a, you guys are seeing like a deep purple, but in the sun, this is a very light, uh, kind of very dark, very light in the middle purple, but it looks great in the sun. You guys can see your, uh, you can see the Kate iPod through it and your engraving and all that good stuff. So thanks for watching. Oh, baby, Brandon signing out. Peace out, guys. I'll catch you in the next video.